Hello, if you're like me, you know Jerry Maguire 1996 is one of the greatest movies of all time. So today, I thought it would be fun if you pulled up a chair by the campfire and watch it again with the entire cast of Then and Now. I will tell you about the original names and ages of the actors and how they changed in 2023. Okay, let's see together. Jerry Maguire's playback to Tom Cruise. In 1996 when filming, he was 34 years old, and now he's living out the life at the age of 60. You're watching, there's even an ESPN crew. So I turned to her, sort of grandly say, well, this is me, klutz. Country, so I always go watch it, films and with other audiences and watch their movies with them. So I do. When I make a film, I want to go see it with an audience. That's fun. That's like the reward. Bob Sugar is playback to Jay Moore. In 1996, when filming, he was 26 years old, and now he's living out the life at the age of 52. You okay? Fine. What's up? Came here to let you go. Uh, you know, it, it, it's really interesting. I, I've, um, I'm realizing now at 52 years old, I've, I, I've had a really cool, great career that. Avery Bishop is played actress Kelly Preston. She was 34 years old when filming in 1996, and sadly on July 12, 2020, she passed away at the age of 57 in Clearwater, Florida, USA. That's everything. Jerry, you and I are salespeople. We sell. I, I'm a, it's I'm not a, love a, me. It's not trust my handshake. Okay. It's make the sale. Get it signed. There should be secret to a good marriage, don't you think? Isn't it? You, yeah, you, you got to keep it signed. Well, we danced in a movie that we met. We did a, I did a scream test for a movie called Big Ray Boyd is playback actor Jonathan Lipnicki. He was six years old when filming in 1996, and now he's living out the life at the age of 32. Oh, just listen to me, you know that feeling? You, they just look at you, they just Let's really... go right now, let's go to the zoo. Ray, the zoo, you know, um, so cool. you know, and it was great. You know, he, I, I didn't even really get along with child actors when I was a child because a lot of them weren't real, you know, and, um... <laughs> Rod Tidwell is played actor Cuba Gooding Jr. He was 28 years old when filming in 1996, and now he's living out the life at the age of 55. You ain't been getting no love from that little Energizer bunny. No, I ain't getting no love from Nike. Rod? Obviously, I ain't getting no love from Reebok. Did I ever tell you about my Reebok story? Rod? When the courts opened, my lawyers said, listen, we could go to trial and we can, you know, show the video. Marcy Titwell is playback actress Regina King. She was 25 years old when filming in 1996, and now she's living out the life at the age of 52. I'm, I'm sorry to interrupt you guys. Now, I don't know what you do for your 4%, but this man, my husband, has a whole plan, an image. And when you put him in a waterbed warehouse... I pester people to do it that way and no one listens to me. Well, you know, like minds. Like, like minds, minds, that's right. Yes. So what happens after you do with the cement on the feet? Do you have like a... T a Scully is played back to Jen Wenner. He was 50 years old when filming in 1996, and now he's living out the life at the age of 77. 33 out-of-shape agents guiding the careers of 1,685 of the most finely tuned athletes alive. We started with nothing. So our choices were limited to what record companies would give us free or movies would give us free. And that was the best of the free ones. Yeah. Now then we did went on and he did many. Dorothy Boyd is playback actress Renee Zellweger. She was 27 years old when filming in 1996. And now she's living out the life at the age of 54. Me too. What you wrote inspired me. I don't know. No, hey, I'm working with you because of that memo. Exercise for keeping you grounded. <laughs> oh, yeah. You you're like, on why, that did carpet, I, why did I like, start oh, this tradition? You know, yeah. Mm, yeah, and it was raining that night, so I was, I was extra grounded when I got oh there. My Bill Dooler is played back to Mark Pellington. He was 34 years old when filming in 1996, and now he's living out the life at the age of 61. Well, he's got to go number one. Oh, he still goes number one, but San Diego wants to trade up with Denver, and they want him bad. What happened to Denver? He's new. This whole chunk of the novel and this whole chunk of the story and the friendship wasn't really complete. 
Frank Cushman is played by actor Jerry O'Connell. He was 18 years old when filming in 1996, and now he's living out the life at the age of 45. Seven years for 30. Signing bonus, eight. Should I unplug the phone? Reporter, Jerry. I've been calling all night long. You just be friendly and you say no comment. Right. Self if I didn't right. come up and say hi. Uh, could I have uh, anything? Uh, That's funny. Uh, even a Twitter handle or something? Um, but um, Martin uh, called up some. Bobby Fallon is playback actress Alexandra Wentworth. She was 31 years old when filming in 1996, and now she's living out the life at the age of 58. Oh, I'm sorry if I was rude just then. It's okay. We're together now. Why is it so easy to talk with you? Out and every kid is different, and so this show is these these couples that are kind of different parenting styles, like free range and discipline and high. Laura Boyd is playback actress Bonnie Hunt. She was 35 years old when filming in 1996, and now she's living on the life at the age of 61. Love him. I love him. And I don't care what you think. I love him for the, for the man he wants to be, and I love him for the man that he almost is. In the emergency room watching us because her white count is up. All the cancer patients out there know what I'm talking about when you're going through chemo and you have that white count go up. It's a little scary, but um, well, we hope... What is your favorite Jerry Maguire character, and what do you think when some actors have passed away? Leave your comments below this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel, and press the bell to wait for my next videos.